What's up, everybody? So about 10 years ago, maybe a little bit more, I got a tattoo. I got a tattoo of my favorite Gandhi quote, be the change you wish to see. And I have it going across my arms. And I have it there, so that way when I greet people, if I give them a hug, they can see and they can hopefully start a conversation. That was my reasoning behind that. However, when I heard that quote, it was very profound for me because at the time I was going through nutrition school and I was learning about different ways of thinking, behaving, and being. And if I wanted to see changes in my clients, in the people around me, in the world, I had to become that change first for myself. So it's a very powerful statement. And it's, it's, it's uh, obviously I have it on my body, so it means a lot to me. And I, I wrote something down today for you guys around that because especially with everything that we're going through right now we're in a moment of change we're in a time of change and oftentimes we want to see change we want things to be different but we want them to happen instead of us creating it so the the goal for today is for you to be the change you be the creator of what it is that you are wanting to change so i wrote this down for you i'm going to read it to you um, so it goes it, it's it's called be the change Creating a movement, starting a revolution, starts with the thoughts, then actions of one person. There's an unwavering fire that burns deep within them. This fire sparks creativity. This fire burns hot with conviction. You know this person the moment you meet them because you can feel it in their presence. You can see it in their eyes and you can hear it in their voice. They are the change they want to create. And this same power and ability is in you. The spark is there, just waiting to catch fire. If you want change, you must first become the change you seek. You have to upgrade your self-talk. You have to think and speak in affirmations. You have to be kind, non-judgmental, listen with empathy and understanding. Instead of wishing situations or people were different, create the difference. Be the mood director of each and every room you enter without expecting reciprocation from others. Be the change for you, for the world that lives between your ears. If you want change, be it and then create it. So that's the goal for you for today and for tomorrow and for the day beyond. Start to change in your mind. Start to change your language and then start to create that. And then people will see it. You know when you walk into a room and someone's energetic, you can feel that. You want to be around that person. Be that person. Okay? Once you be that person for yourself, again, within that world between your ears, people will start to see it and people will start to notice. So be the change. If you have any questions, any comments, feel free to reach out, leave them in the message in the comment sections below. And I hope this helps share it with someone you think would benefit from it. And we'll see you soon.